My name is Lance Nunes, and in this video I'll be teaching you how to do the right turn at the halt. The purpose of this movement is to enable you as an individual or as a body of men to turn 90 degrees to the right in a smart, uniform and soldier-like manner. Look in for a full demonstration of the movement to be carried out upon receiving the word of command, right turn. In structure only. Right turn. As you can see, upon receiving the word of command, right turn, I pivoted on my left ball and right heel, 90 degrees to the right, lifted my leg up 90 degrees from the ground, and st stamped it down next to my right foot. My upper body remained square and erect to the front. For purpose of instruction, this movement can be carried out can be broken down into three parts, each part numbered. Look in for a full demonstration of the right turn, one. Instructor only. Right turn, one. So, as you can see, upon receiving the word of command, right turn, one, I pivoted on my left ball and right heel, 90 degrees to the right. My arms remained by my side and my shoulders remained square to the front. From here, we can move on to the right turn two. Looking for a full demonstration of the right turn two. Right turn two. So as you can see, my leg came up 90 degrees from the ground and I stamped my left foot next to my right. I moved on the ones and stood still on the two threes. This allows for the regulation times of 40 movements per minute, which will allow you to perform draw movements correctly. The left turn at the halt is essentially the same as the right turn, except reversed. So, looking for full demonstration of the left turn at the halt. Instructor only. Left turn. So as you can see, I simply turned to the left, 90 degrees to the left, and stamped in with my right foot rather than my left. The timings for this movement are the same as for the right turn. Those were the left and right turns at the halt. Next video, I will be teaching you the about turn at the halt.